So after the user logs in, they will see this main home screen. It's uh, decorated with the metro design, same as the Windows 8 tiles. So this tiles is made of the list box items and the hub toolkit from the phone control toolkit. And this app is for tertiary students to connect and use their app for uh, un university life or tertiary education life. So over here they have the friends. So the friends uh, will be displayed here. The data is from the Amazon Web MySQL database and the service I'm using on this phone is the WCF that's hosted on Microsoft Azure. So this app works anywhere, it doesn't have it doesn't have to be on the local host, so you can see here I'm using uh, my house Wi-Fi. So over here is the two friends I have on this account. It's uh, John and Anthony. So the, na the name and the picture, the distance is displayed. So I can see how far my friend is from me. So let's go over here and click on Anthony. So when we select Anthony, we see we see our location over here. You see the smiley face, uh, and then you will see where Anthony is. So Anthony's over there. So when you want to meet each other, or I want to go over at his house, I can choose to route to the friend. So it will route me to my destination which is my friend Anthony so I can depart my house I can drive or walk or cycle and in the end I'll reach Anthony's location so instead of searching for a place to go I can directly find my friend this is very useful if uh, we're meeting somewhere but I'm lost so instead of looking for the place I can look for my friend and behind this feature is the geolocation background sync so it's a scheduled periodic update it can be changed in this setting so I can use the slider and change the frequency and I can choose to start it or can stop it but for now we, we don't we don't want to stop it but we'll reduce the frequency time so that we'll be able to see the location updating so this background task runs when the app is not running so it will take some time for for it to run but we can see it over here in the settings we can see that uh, there's a background task for our app Unific so it's on and let's give it some time to run